happening. <laughs> I forgot that this was happening in the background. I'll say hello, everyone. It's me, Purple Walker, here at at an IHOP, which is why you hear people say free, 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 free repo in the background. And I'm here with Mimi Force members, Captain Soldier 76, looking at his wallet. Hello. And Jace. Hello. And you are here to tell us about, so Jace, as you can tell from uh, one of the previous videos I did, he does artwork, he, but he also does it for when he's being paid, he gets commissions, <laughs> not when he's being told, uh, when he's in, in, indisposed to draw something, <laughs> he'll draw stuff for money. Uh, and he was just asked what was one of the worst commissions he's ever had to do, or at least been tasked to do. And now this is his story <laughs> that we will share with you today. CSI. <laughs> yes. So the worst commission I've been asked to draw, and I, like most people have really silly go-tos, like furries and things like that. And I think the furry community is actually really nice. Uh, we had a uh, noted friend, Hope, from To Be Released as a furry and a very nice girl. Yeah. A lot of furries are fantastic people. They commission people. They, they pay up front. Like, they, they bring a lot to the table for the art community. Yeah. I think furries are fantastic. That's I'm true. not one, but... No. Yeah. Know. But uh, more power to that community. No, the worst commission I received was... It, it was in high school. And I actually never drew it because I had to turn it down. <laughs> and it was a, a friend who uh, I had class with. And he was like, hey, you draw art, right? I'm like, yeah, I do. <laughs> He's like, well, where do you post your art? Like, on DeviantArt? He's like, oh, all right, cool. I've got a DeviantArt, too. Uh, I'm going to send you a commission. I was like, all right, cool, cool. Sounds good. So I get this DeviantArt message. And it is a couple paragraphs long. That's always a good sign. <laughs> it was one of the most horrendous things to find out about a person. <laughs> that you that you see on a daily basis, <laughs> that you're like somewhat good friends with. <laughs> Wait, did he ask you like for a two paragraph long art fetish or something? Or? Yes, it oh. was it was it was fetish art. It was, but like on top of that, it was a self portrait. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that also, you know how writers don't know. <laughs> don't understand the concept of listen this is a single panel in a comic book and you have multiple actions happening at once this is too many things to happen in this one image mm -hmm. you're asking for multiple images but he wanted a single image of this entire action <laughs> and I will not name his name and we will not name my name. <laughs> no, it is Jace. <laughs> and we'll all be better for it. Yeah. So what he asked for was... Do you guys know what Vor, Vor is? Yes. Yeah. Very familiar. <laughs> yes. All right, cool. Cool. Uh, for the listeners at home who don't know what Vor is, um, look it up. <laughs> <laughs> Go to Vor.com. <laughs> Google it. Have fun. Uh, but... To, for the most part, it's a very particular fetish where people like seeing things eaten or themselves eaten or characters eaten by another character. Yeah. This is what my friend was into. <laughs> Two paragraphs worth <laughs> of being into it. Yes. So he wanted a photo of him being eaten by a large naga, which is like a snake creature. From wow, a naga is like uh, a mythical snake creature. Yeah, oh, just a naga in general. In general, um, so he wanted a giant snake woman in this one photo. Keep in mind, it's all one photo. He wants all these things. He wants her to eat him, swallow him, go through her throat, be devoured into her stomach, and then uh, 
to re-release from her body. <laughs> it is as cool. not, not as excrement, but in an egg. In an egg, which is then pushed out by her and then hatches. Okay. I paid cash. <laughs> so he I already got it. <laughs> So he, that's what he wanted in one image for $20. Hey, that's not bad. That's shit. Oh, wait, no, never mind. That's Garbo. For what is essentially a two drawing. <laughs> what is essentially like a two page comic at minimum. Because unless he's gonna do fucking like uh, action lines to show the, the, the time pooping? Is, yeah. The pooping. The birthing. It's the not a pooping. Are you right? The birthing. <laughs> the birthing. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> so yeah, I and I, I sat on that message for a good couple hours, and I was like, I can't not respond to him. I'm gonna see him at school tomorrow. Like, <laughs> what am I gonna do? I can't draw this one because it's super weird, and then two because holy crap, that's a lot of things. Mm-hmm. So then I just kind of like leaned on it, and I was like, you know what? Hey. I messaged him back. I was like, hey, you're asking for a lot of detail. And I don't think I could provide that level of detail that you're seeking (laughs) for in this commission. Uh, It's probably best to find a a, a different artist that's more skilled than I am. (laughs) I was about to say, like, if if I was asked that, I was like, I'm not good enough to draw this, bro. I'm sorry. Yeah. My current skill set is like I did not train down my skill tree in this specific set of. I'm not ready to draw individual scales on a, a snake woman that yeah, has it's like the scales that are too <laughs> has like a transparent like and he he like he went into detail with like oh yeah there's like a slime on the eggs there's like a like a goo a transparent goo Ooh, and it's yeah, like it was very very detailed. specific. Never <laughs> look at that guy the same again, and we kind of drifted away as friends. <laughs> Mad respect to that guy, where he's like, "Man, this could kill a friendship, but I don't care. <laughs> I need this made. <laughs> I need to be horny on main." <laughs> the crazy thing is that he didn't even try and do like a secret commission. Does he think that? Because- yeah, yeah. Like he could have, he could have like messaged me with an account he just made. And not said it was him. I could. It could have not been him. Maybe he was looking for a discount. Maybe he, knew he was looking, <laughs> looking for that too friend much. discount. He was like, <laughs> "We friends, so I know this would cost upwards to sixty dollars." But because we're friends, I think twenty's pretty good. <laughs> he wants that art, but he also wants that friend discount. Exactly. The friend discount I have for <laughs> for whatever bullshit they're all excited for my given time. <laughs> Those aren't even. Any any quality. To say, so I did need a drawing of a whooper being eaten by a survivor. No! And then the survivor forms a Pokemon egg at the end. No, God, no, please. Okay, I need the before action just to keep it a one where the whooper, it, it, you can tell he's super not into what's about to happen. So he's kind of scared. Fine, I will do it for the cover. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> so, there you go, uh, Captain Ginyu. That, that is my worst commission story. And it happened very early on in my, I guess, career. <laughs> or before my career even fucking started. It makes me scared. <laughs> you should be scared. And with that, we'll end it for this video. Thank you for sharing something from the art community that is deeply, <laughs> deeply disturbing. <laughs> and you'll find us next time as I continue making whatever video I feel like. So we'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.